Latest developments tonight in the Kelly Clayton murder case. Suspected murderer Thomas Clayton back behind bars tonight after allegedly violating a judge's order. Good evening, I'm Renata Steele. Thank you for choosing WENY News at 6 o'clock. Clayton back in Catontown Court this morning after police investigated a claim he tried to contact his kids. WENY's Logan Wilson was at Clayton's arraignment and joins us now with how this recent arrest impacts the murder investigation. Logan? Renata, he was released on $250,000 bail on Monday. Not even 48 hours later, he's back behind bars, and he's going to have to come up with a lot more money if he wants to get out of jail. The defendant violated the order of protection that was issued when he was arraigned. Uh, when Judge Patusik arraigned him on the murder charges, there was an order of protection issued in favor of the two minor children and also in favor of the woman who was taking care of those children. The allegation is that he engaged in some uh, conduct with led to communication with those folks and therefore he violated the court's order, which is a new charge of criminal contempt of the second degree. According to District Attorney Brooks Baker, the woman taking care of Clayton's children told police Clayton tried to reach her through text messages. Tuesday evening, the Steuben County Sheriff's Office investigators and New York State Police investigators began looking into the claim and an arrest warrant was issued at 1 this morning. Clayton was arrested around 9 while spotted leaving a hotel in the town of Sir, Ithaca and was like arraigned in town of Caton Court before being taken back to jail. This is a misdemeanor charge, so the court will have him back here on another date. Uh, he's been remanded to Superman County Jail on half a million dollars bail, and uh, the, the rest of the case continues as it continues. We are, it, it's a fluid investigation. We're developing new leads every day. The new criminal contempt charge will play a factor in the murder investigation. Clayton is charged with second-degree murder in the death of his wife, Kelly. Kelly's body was found in their home on Ganan Road in Caton on September 29th. After his arrest on the murder charge, the judge issued orders of protection for the couple's children and witnesses. An order Clayton is now accused of violating. One of our concerns that I expressed in front of Judge Brasserie was he, the children are victims in this case uh, and uh, that he might try to reach out and contact them. And that's exactly what he did. So uh, that's why the bail is set so high at this point. Clayton is scheduled to appear in town of Caton Court again on November 2nd. The murder case is still set to be presented to a county grand jury. Stay with WENY News for updates and continuing coverage on this story. Reporting in the studio, Logan Wilson, WENY News.